Hey guys, Mikey here. Welcome back to another short video of the data analysis basics in our video series. So today we'll be looking at how to find the names of rows and columns in an R data frame. So let's first create a simple data frame like this here. Okay, so well here we have five columns and six rows. So now we will try to determine the names of each of the columns and rows. So here in this case it's kind of okay since we have only very few rows and columns but when we have really large data set we might want to just uh, check out the names of the rows and see whether the ones we need are really there. So for finding the names of the columns we can just use the names function. Another option for this is the call names function. So both gives the same result. For rows we can use a row dot names function. So here uh, you can see that the rows are just one two three four five six so that's what we got here. Again like always there are multiple ways of doing these things. I'm just giving one example that I'm most familiar with. And here uh, since we just have rows like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 I just thought I will show you guys how to change them as well. So here we will just try to see uh, to change it from 1 to 6 to 11 to 16. For that we can just assign the new values to the row names here. So once we run this code now if you see like you can see that the row names have changed and in fact actually by um, using the dim names function you can get the names of columns and rows together so if you just run this here you can get the names of the rows as well as the names of the columns so well that's all for now thanks for watching guys i'll see you in the next video ciao